So in this video I'm going to talk about the comments uh, page builder element. Now to sh uh, explain you what this uh, this element does. Uh, this element is basically uh, of course the comments part of a, a blog post and uh, it's uh, strictly used inside the page builder. So for example if you're building um, uh, blog post which you want to uh, I don't know customize it with uh, the page builder to uh, display other things or to even more customize it you can um, use this element and uh, it will uh, automatic automatically display the comments of uh, the page now the of course to explain better I should probably just uh, uh, show you so uh, <clears throat> we have this uh, blog post um, don't don't be uh, surprised about this I probably changed the uh, style of the uh, subheader anyway uh, I will try to transform this uh, this exact uh, page into a page builder page so first I have to edit the post and I will enable the page builder edit this page with a page builder and as you can see I'm going to hide this header I'm going to delete this section because I want to start from uh, scratch so I'm first going to start with the subheader Ca custom subheader I'm going to for the sake of this uh, tutorial I'm going to change this uh, properly I'm going to create a new section I'm going to add the element called post content as you can see it's automatically added but the comments of course are missing now I won't add the, the sidebar I already explained how that element works so I'm just going to jump over the comments so as you can see the uh, form has uh, has appeared now it's empty as you can see there's there are no uh, no comments but um, if I were to comment they would appear here like for example let's let's take this page uh, from what I know yeah exactly this one has uh, two uh, demo comments so this uh, would appear now of course like I said if there are no comments uh, only this form uh, appears so that's about it like I said you probably want to add I don't know there's literally tens of element elements here so you can add almost anything you want without worrying you might lose something so if I I just disable the page builder the page will look like uh, it did before sorry about that I just did uh, a refresh on this page because uh, I was uh, the fact that the background didn't appear in this uh, custom subheader got me thinking and wanted to make sure everything uh, is uh, fine so this is it uh, if you do have questions uh, please uh, don't forget to uh, also subscribe uh, to our support forums and uh, thanks for watching see you in see you into the next one bye